Good morning. Welcome to my spring morning routine. I wake up at 6.30 and the first thing I do is grab my phone. Maybe not the best way to start your morning, but that's the life of an online businesswoman, I guess. I always check my inbox and also my Instagram and like to respond to any of your comments. And if you want to see more of me, you can follow me on my Instagram page as well, which is lilylight.com. When I finally get out of my bed, I like to start my morning with a glass of cold water and a lemon. I personally find it very hard to drink enough water every day, so by ensuring that I drink a glass of water immediately when I wake up, I at least have some water going into my system every day. Drinking lemon juice every morning helps in maintaining your pH balance of the body and it also gives you a boost of energy and kickstarts your digestion. Every morning, I make my bed. Making your bed every morning is correlated with better productivity, a greater sense of well-being, and stronger skills at sticking with a budget. Based on the research of the Pulitzer Prize winner Charles Duhigg in his book The Power of Habit. Since you're making your bed at the start of the day, it makes you feel like you've already crossed off one thing of your to-do list. And it helps you with creating a pattern of good behavior for the rest of the day. I've been trying to incorporate even more healthy habits into my morning routine by doing short yoga sessions every morning. I grab my workout gear and I head downstairs to my gym in my apartment building. You don't need a lot of time in the mornings at all. My yoga sessions are between 10 to 15 minutes, so anyone can spare that in the morning if you wake up a little bit earlier. And it ensures that you're starting your day feeling empowered, healthy, and happy. After that, it is time to enjoy a warm and cozy shower. I personally love adding a little bit of me time in every morning routine and my personal favorite way to do that is by pampering myself with my favorite beauty products. I use a face wash, I wash my body with a shower oil and a scrub and I nourish my hair with a shampoo and conditioner. And oh yeah, a little bit of a chore, but I also have to shave my body because I like to have smooth legs. After getting out of the shower and into a bathrobe, it's time for my skincare routine. And recently I've been trying to simplify my skincare routine and instead focus on facial massage using my rose quartz roller. Not only does it look stunning in your bathroom, it also feels very nice and cooling on your skin. And if you're struggling with morning puffiness, this is a great little tool to use. At this point my stomach is probably rumbling, so it's time to get some food into my system. You should never skip your breakfast, because it is the most important meal of the day and it jumpstarts your metabolism, which helps you burn more calories throughout the day, based on the research of Christy C. Tangne, a PhD clinical dietitian. I love starting my day with smoothie bowls or smoothies because they honestly taste like a treat, but they're actually very healthy for you. Another thing that I've been trying to do is add some spinach in every meal that I eat. Spinach is 
very very healthy for you. Spinach is loaded with nutrients such as vitamin A, vitamin C, folic acid, iron and calcium. So it's a great idea to add spinach or a leafy green to every meal you eat and by adding it to your already very sweet smoothie you won't even taste it. I also like to get a little bit caffeinated every morning, so I make myself a coffee with almond creamer and some foamed up oat milk. Mornings can be quite stressful, but if you have the time, I enjoy being a little bit more mindful about eating my breakfast and drinking my coffee. I like to sit in my favorite reading corner in my room and just enjoy the beautiful view and this moment. I also like to do some reading, from reading an astrology book or reading the Washington Post. I like to keep things quite versatile. Now that my body is all fed and nourished, it is time to focus a little bit on my appearance and apply some makeup. I usually like to watch a YouTube video while I'm getting ready and for me personally, giving myself that time in the morning to get ready, even if I work from home, just gives me a boost of confidence. I guess I'm just a big lover for beautiful makeup products. After that, it's time to get dressed, apply some perfume and wear my favorite jewelry. On days that I don't wash my hair, I usually don't do that much to it. I usually detangle it, nourish it with an oil and apply some hair perfume to smell nice. Now that I'm all done and ready to conquer the world, it is time to create a plan or a schedule for that day. I always use my trusty Supplied by Lily Lifestyle Desk Planner in luxurious rose gold. Honestly, I cannot live without this thing. I use it daily and my life has been so much more organized and productive ever since I've been using my planner. If you want to order yours as well, shipping is international, I will have linked it in the description box down below. And funny fact, I actually have a page dedicated to creating your seasonal routine as well, which I'm obviously now also going to fill out now that I created my spring morning routine. So pretty much the last thing that I like to do every morning is get in a 10 minute clean. One of the questions I get quite often is how I manage to keep my apartment looking so tidy and clean. And one of my secrets for that is using the 10 minute cleaning method. Every morning I like to dedicate 10 minutes of my time to clean my apartment. I set a 10 minute timer and then I just start cleaning as much as I can in those 10 minutes. Now that my apartment is all tidy, I'm almost ready to go. I like to pack my bag and usually this is a very easy process for me because I keep all my everyday necessities in this little, actually it's a plant pot, that I got from H&M Home and this way I am sure that I'm bringing all the stuff that I need with me. And that's the end of my morning routine. I either spend my days working from home or I have to go to meetings, events or photo shoots. But whatever I have to do with this morning routine, I ensure that I start my day positively and productive. We 
are at the end of my spring morning routine for 2019 and I really hope you guys enjoyed this video and can we take a little moment for the fact that I'm finally early with posting a seasonal related video. In the four years that I've been on YouTube I always feel like I posted any spring, summer, fall or winter routine video, fashion video, whatever, way too late into the season already but now I'm finally posting stuff ahead so I hope you guys can give me a little thumbs up to appreciate that effort although I'm probably going to be running late with any other thing in my life but at least I have one thing that is on time if you want me to do a spring nighttime routine as well please give this video a thumbs up and if we hit the three K likes, 3000 likes, I will definitely post that video as well. Leave me a comment down below if you want to chit chat with me and don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel if you want to see more of me. I hope you're all having a very good day and I'll talk to you later. Bye guys! Mm -hmm.